All right, so check it out. I'm about to wrap it up for the day. Um, hold on, let me cut off my dryer. So we're not hearing that in the background. Oh, you can see my dirty, disgusting house. No! <laughs> hold on. There you go. All right, so anyway, so uh, just about to wrap it up for today. Today is uh, March um, 19th, 2021. And I uh, just want to give you guys a little bit of um, an update. 19th? Yeah, Friday, March 19th, 2021, about 10.30 at night. Just wanted to give everybody a little update um, on where I am. Change clothes. How about the shower? Finished up this little homework project that my, um, that my cousin, my family friend, uh, gave me as far as um, getting my business plan together and helping myself to get investors and whatnot. Um, for the secret menu, um, the secret menu LV. Um, what happened? So over the last couple of days, I was able to get my business license. Um, I was able to get an EIN number because now that with the official business license, I'm, I should probably cut notifications off when I do this, but I remember for the next time, I want it to be authentic. Hopefully no creepy crawlies is crawling around the house. That's a little too authentic. I'm, I'll, I'll erase it then, but no, but Check it out, so uh, I got my EIN number through the IRS, I got my business license, so I'm officially registered to the Secretary of State. Uh, the next couple of things that I wanna, oh well, okay, so I got a gentleman from Fiverr. Um, I'll shout him out uh, sooner or later. Um, he's working on my logo and he's been sending me some drafts and let me tell you, it's looking so good. And I think I'm gonna try to keep this a little bit of a secret for a while before I show off the logo. I've sent it to one person, two people. I sent it to my girlfriend. Um, at the time of filming this, Elizabeth Gomez is my girlfriend. Let's hope we stay that way when I, you know, when I uh, uh, release this. But I sent it to her and I did show my barber because I wanted her to see my vision and see if she seen where I was going without telling her. You know, if you tell somebody what an image is, their brain understands it and they see it and they're like, oh, that's a blank. But if you say, hey, what do you think about this? And they say, oh, well, what's that in the background? Okay, then you didn't. Uh, so anyway, so I hit my guy back up from Fiverr and I told him uh, what it was and what it wasn't and what we could do to make, this, make it better. I mean, I get a couple of revisions, I'm paying them, so that's good to know that he's taking care of it like that. And then, um, what else? So I got that working. Um, I'm excited about that, about the, um, about the logo. Um, I got the website in, in the process of working right now. Um, I'm going through Wix, really good, really user friendly, really simple. I'm liking Wix, but because I need my logo to finish up, I want to base my site around my logo. And my logo is starting to look a little cartoony, which there's nothing wrong with that. I wanted that anime style. And the Wix um, website that I'm creating is more it's really classical coffee shop, you know, upscale. And not to say that we can't potentially be upscale, but I want my logo is more fun than that. So, and the website template that I'm using is kind of stiff, kind of hoity-toity, if you will. Not in a bad way, just it doesn't fit what I'm going with right now. So, um, with that said, uh, I'm gonna get back on that in later dates, but I was able to get the website. So it's the 19th and I'm just talking about this. This actually all happened like two days ago on a Wednesday. So this is the 19th on a Friday. I got paid on late Wednesday night and I was up till 4 a.m. just grinding it out. Uh, hit up Wix, hit up GoDaddy. I hit up the uh, the Nevada State Department of getting your business license. I can't think of them, whatever the name of that is. Uh, I tried to do the IRS thing that night, but it didn't work. Um, but by the time I woke up, four hours later, um, I was able to go to the IRS website and I was able to take care of it. You know, I was able to get my EIN number. So hit the ground running. Uh, my first major hiccup is I tried to apply for a business credit card and I went to Chase. So I've been following this lady on YouTube. Shouts out to Noel. Uh, I might link the description. I don't know. We'll see what I'm doing. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just talking. Now I'm trying to talk like a YouTuber. I might not link no description. Don't like, don't subscribe, don't share. I don't care. I'm just talking. Anyway, so <laughs> I was following this Noel lady and she was giving me all this advice and one of the banks that she was mentioning was Chase, but I, I combined two different videos. I don't have very good credit at the moment. So going to Chase wasn't for the people like me. It was for people with better credit. So 
I got a pull on my credit, I'm sure, just for them to deny me to get a Chase bank account. So I'm gonna wait a couple of days. Um, this Monday, I'm supposed to meet up with um, BVAA. I forget at the moment what bank I'm meeting up with, but I got the address on my phone, the same phone I'm recording with. Um, and they're gonna talk to me about a business account, so I'm excited about that. Um, give me one second, because I don't wanna have been talking all this time. And we're not recording. Okay, we're still recording. You know, you know, I won't be doing this two or three times, but so I'm gonna check them out um, and see if I can get a business account. And then I talked to my barber. Once, shouts out to Nicole the barber on Craig and Nellis. You know what I'm saying? She hook it up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, anyway, so Michelle, uh, excuse me, Nicole the barber. She uh, was telling me that um, that U.S. Bank. All I gotta do is bring my business license, this, that, and the third up there, and like, you know, we're good to go. Have my EIN number and everything. And I'm not saying, I don't know if she's got good credit or bad credit, but they gave her a business check-in. So, get the business check-in. I can start getting business credit cards. I can start getting business loans. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm currently banking with Bank of America, and I've seen an area where they'll let me get a business bank account, but I don't want to jump on that just yet in case they, they pull in my credit again just to say no. So I'm going to talk to these next two entities before I go back to Bank of America because Bank of America know me better than anybody. They didn't know how many times I didn't overdraft. They didn't know how many times I didn't ask for overdraft forgiveness. Uh, they see what the money coming in, so they might look at me like, we don't trust you with no business account if you, you know, you love money like that. So... Yeah. We'll see. So anyway, got the business license, got the website, even though it's not done, or the domain name, I should say. Started working on the website. The logo will be done by the time I wake up in the morning, I guarantee, because this guy is like killing it. Um, got a haircut, not relevant, but I got one. Um, and yeah, and I just finished the homework that I was given um, by uh, my cousin, who's going to look over it and hopefully potentially invest. So we'll see. Um, if I get the investment, cool. If I don't, I don't. And um, shout out to my family and my friends and my girlfriend and everybody who's willing to invest and put some money in, into this project. But I'm going to do it regardless. Do I want my cousin's money, my mama's money, my sister's money, my girlfriend's money? Absolutely. But if it doesn't come to fruition, then it's cool because I'm going to do this. This is going to happen. I've never been more serious about a project in my life outside of like Sun Krillin rapping. So um, it's going to happen. That I'm not trying to belittle anybody's contribution, but if life happens and something happens and they can't invest or they choose not to or the money's not right or I can't promise to pay them back in the, uh, the way as expediently or whatever is possible, then that's fine. Please, you know, I, no hard feelings. Um, just to have your love and support, just to have their love and support um, is enough for me. Um, so we'll see. Whether it's today, whether it's tomorrow, whether it's this time next year, uh, the secret menu LV will be up and running. So um, that's my little blog for the day. Blog for the day. Um, I don't have anything else to update on. I guess I'm catching up for the last two, three days. Uh, once again, I did get a new tripod. So I'm going to start filming with my um, trusty, dusty. Uh, Apple iPad, you know, uh, and when I actually have it up and running, I want to uh, uh, want to film with the iPad and just go through a day in the life of what uh, the secret menu looks like, um, and then maybe in the future I can give people tips and tricks on how to how to complete this process as well, and maybe um, skip over the stumbling box, speed bumps, and, and, and detours that I had to do, uh, and you know, just give you a better understanding of what's up. So. Uh, pay it forward. So that's it. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. If you're tuning in, if not, then you know, hey, thank you, future Aaron, uh, or you're welcome, future Aaron, for all of the grinding that past Aaron had to do to get you to future status. And you're welcome, future kids. You know what I'm saying? Harley, Evie, Selena, who uh, might uh, inherit what I'm doing right now. So you're welcome. Uh, and better take care of my business because I'll come back and, and, and whoop y'all butt, whether it's come back from vacation in Florida or come back from the dead. Y'all better take care of my business. So we'll check and see what's going on. Thank you. Bye-bye.